Welcome, dear sellers. In this video of Galileo Seller Success Series, we will show you how you can list your items in Galileo Marketplace. To list your items, you need to log into the seller account. Enter your email address. Now enter the password. Once you successfully log in, click on this Add New button, and here is where you can add your new product from. Let's start filling this. Start with a name and a short description. You can utilize various styling options available here, such as bold, italics, and underline. Additionally, you can use bullet points, ordered lists, and more to enhance the presentation. It's up to your imagination to customize the appearance according to your branding. I have now added the short description. Additionally, I can choose to highlight specific words using italics like this. Now let's move on to the long description. Although the long description is optional, it significantly enhances your listing credibility. If you want to where it will be added, you can click on view more details. This will show you how your long description will appear. This will be added in the additional detail sections of the product details page. Now let's add the long description. Similarly, you can apply various styles to the long description. We want this section to stand out a bit more, so we'll change it to a headline. Next, you can select the category that best fits your product. Currently, this product is categorized under jewelry. You can also add product tags to help with the search optimization of your product. You can include up to three tags. Now, we are in the general section. Here, you can set the price for your item. There are two fields, one for the regular price and one for the sale price. The regular price is the standard price of your item. The sale price is the discounted price at which you want to sell the item. For example, if you set a regular price of $2,000 and a sale price of $1,800, the item will be available for $1,800 during the sale, which is a 10% discount off the regular price. For now, I'll set the regular price to $2,000 and offer a 10% discount by setting the sale price to $1,800. The tax class for this item will be set to standard by default. Next, navigate to the media section and upload your media files. This includes images, videos, and any 3D models you may have, which is optional. You can select and upload multiple images at once. The image marked with a star will be set as the primary image. Ensure that the front view image is selected as the primary image for better presentation. Let's also upload a video for this listing. Now let's go to the inventory section. Here, you can manage the quantity of items you have available. For example, if you have 10 rings in stock, you would enter 10 in this section. You can update this number anytime to reflect changes in your inventory. Click on preview to see how it looks. Now it's time to add a shipping method. We support multiple shipping options, including flat rate shipping, free shipping, and carrier calculated shipping, which is currently in beta. If you select flat rate shipping, please enter the shipping cost for a single item. Additionally, you have the option to check a box if you prefer not to charge extra for orders with multiple items. If you choose free shipping, no shipping cost will be charged to the customer. If you opt for carrier calculated shipping, you can enter the weight, length, breadth, and height of the item. Additionally, you can specify a shipping cost adjustment. You can add a 10% to 15% adjustment cost, which will be applied to the shipping cost calculated by our system. This adjusted amount will be collected from the buyer. This adjustment helps protect sellers from fluctuations in shipping prices. As mentioned, our carrier calculated shipping engine is currently in beta. There may be instances where it fails to estimate shipping prices accurately. In such cases, you can choose how to handle the purchase. You may decide to either prevent the buyer from completing the purchase or allow the purchase with a flat rate shipping cost. For carrier calculated shipping to function properly, you need to add a warehouse and select the warehouse from which the item will be shipped. For this listing, I will choose flat rate shipping and collect an extra amount for multiple copies purchased. 
Therefore, I will leave the option to not collect extra costs unchecked. Let's move on to the properties section. Properties help buyers understand your product better by providing more details. You can add multiple properties here, which will be displayed in the property section of the product details page. To add a property, you can choose from various types, such as text, number, or date. For simplicity, I'll select text for this example. When you click add, a pop-up will appear for you to enter the details. I'll add several properties now. Once you've added your properties, you can also attach proof for each one. For example, I have a certificate indicating that the item is 18K gold-plated. I will attach its proof document. After adding the proof, it will be displayed with your property details. You can replace or view the document as needed. With that complete, you can now proceed to the Authenticity Files section. In the Authenticity Files section, you can upload documents that provide proof of authenticity for your product. For instance, I you have an authenticity certificate for this ring, I can upload the document by providing a name for the file and selecting the file to upload. This feature ensures that your buyers have access to official documentation supporting the authenticity and value of the product. After adding the details, you can save your changes. Once you've made your updates, you can save your changes. If needed, you can edit these details again by clicking on the Edit button and continue with editing. Alternatively, if everything looks good and you're ready, you can list the item. If you prefer to preview the item before listing it, simply click on the Preview button. This will show you a preview of the item, including the name we added, the short description, stock, sale price, regular price, and discount. Additionally, you'll see the proof of authenticity that we've added, along with the properties and any additional details. The buyer can view the video by clicking on it, and they can also view multiple images for a better look at the product. A concise description, along with a brief short description and an explanatory long description or additional details, will help the buyer understand and view the product better, leading to informed decisions and reducing the likelihood of returns. Once you confirm that everything is correct, you can proceed to list the item for sale. After listing, it will be successfully available for purchase. Thanks for watching and happy selling in the marketplace.